Hello everyone, how's your day today? Because my day was great. So today at the end of this video, I actually have stuff to tell you guys. So watch the whole video because there's going to be announcements at the end. Well, today we're going to be jumping straight into the video. So let's go ahead and get started. If you can't tell by the title already, you know, right up there. Today I'm going to be telling you guys 20 things I've learned about middle school. I recently just left middle school because I finished middle school and now I'm going to high school. But if you're still in middle school and you're going to middle school next year, or something like that, or you're in elementary now, or now a freaking sixth grader, I don't know. Whatever the case is, there is so many things different from elementary and middle school. As of right now in our society, there are so many rumors about middle school saying that it's bad, there's so many rumors saying that it's good. Honestly, I think middle school is great. So today, I'm going to be explaining to you guys 20 things I've learned in my three years of middle school, so let's go ahead and get started with that. Number one, it is a big change from going to elementary to middle because the work, I'm going to tell you guys right now, the work is very different, you could say, and the teachers kind of like interpretate things differently from elementary teachers. It's not like, okay, here's your paper, you get a sticker when you're done. No, middle school is not like that. Number two, middle school is not as bad as people say. People say this, that, you can't make many friends in middle school, this, that. Yes, you can. You can make so many new friends in middle school. Like me, when I moved from elementary, to my middle school, or, or not anymore, but like when I moved to elementary to middle school, I've made so many new friends who support me in every way. You just have to find the right person or the right people. Number three, I would have to say middle school teachers are way more strict than elementary teachers. Um, middle school teachers, all in all, they're very strict, but they're very nice. But there's just like so many teachers that are just chill and laid back, you know? You just, it's, it's weird. Because I bet when you go to middle school, you're going to see one teacher that's like chill and laid back and then go to another teacher and be like, that's really mean. Because I had a really mean teacher when I was in 8th grade and I had a really nice teacher when I was in 8th grade. There's always, there, each teacher is their own different way. I don't know how to explain it, but it's weird. Four, indeed you have way more work than you would have in elementary school and you have to do way more projects. Number five, there's way more haters in middle school than there is in elementary but like I said before, just ignore them. Just be like, okay, bye. Like, because they're the people that are trying to bring you down even though they're already below you and you're above them. So just don't listen to them no matter what they say and you'll be totally fine. Number six, there is a lot of fake friends in middle school and a lot of real friends in middle school. You just really have to be careful who you're friends with. Number seven, in middle school, there are some people who you could be best friends with for two years or even more and then not be friends with them anymore because things change that's what i'm trying to say is things change throughout the years of middle school things are going to change and i'm going to let you guys know that right now people are going to change when people change it could be very hard but just ignore them if they change that's okay just be like okay i don't want to be your friend anymore or something like that because if you don't like the way they're changing and if you think they're gonna affect you in a bad way just do not be friends with them because I don't want you guys to have friends who you don't feel are your real friends. Do you get what I'm saying? Number eight, participate in a lot of school activities because you meet new people. It's really fun. It depends on what it is. If you like it, participate in it. Don't be afraid because you meet so many new people and it's just really fun. Number nine, do not, and I'm saying guys, do not be afraid to be yourself, be you in every way and do you in every way. And last but not least, you guys, number 10, Take care of all your schoolwork. Take care of all your grades before anything else. Like if you have a YouTube channel, do all your work before you film a video. Or if you do, I don't know what you do, but if you have practice for a game or something, do your schoolwork. If you if you don't have time after school, stay at tutorials. Because let me tell you guys, if you don't finish your schoolwork for middle school, your grades are gonna go like, boop, like your grades are gonna drop dramatically. Like, really bad. And I know a lot of you who are were in middle school with me are probably like, Anthony, why are you saying that? No, but for real, you guys, me, I took, like, there was a point in middle school where I didn't do my schoolwork. And I was just focused on my YouTube channel too much. And I was like, whoa. Then my, I just kept seeing my grades, like, go from 100 to 90 to 80 to 60 to 30. I was like, oh, no. So I had to bring that back up. But, of course, I'm still focused on my YouTube channel because... I love making videos for you guys. I love entertaining you guys. So yeah, that was like, yeah, yeah, 
yeah, yeah. Also, you guys, the announcement I wanted to tell you guys was I did not upload a video yesterday because I was working on my vlog channel. Woo! Yes, that's right. I now have a vlog channel. I'm going to be uploading vlogs daily. There's really no schedule. You just have to have your notifications on for that channel. Um, you guys are probably like, Anthony, we don't have the channel name. Like, what the heck? Are you just not going to give it to us? Please go subscribe to my vlog channel. And also, don't forget that this is still going to be my main channel. Just the other channels for vlogs so every time I take a trip. But I'm going to be vlogging a lot this summer, so make sure you go subscribe to that channel and turn on the post notifications. The channel link should be popping up up here somewhere. You guys should see some white thing, like, sliding across the screen. I don't know which way it's going to slide across from. But please go subscribe to my vlog channel. It would mean so much to me. Also, the link to my vlog channel is also down below in the description. Also, another thing I want to say, guys, is don't forget to fan me on you now. I'm going to be going live a lot this summer. I went live last night, and our broadcast was lit. So everyone who was there, it was lit. Um, but I'm going to be going live a lot more this summer, so make sure you go fan me on you now. The link is also down below in the description. And that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't be ordinary, and don't let people judge you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you have not already, and I will see you guys again this Wednesday. Bye. If I don't make that, then I switch my flight, and I'll be right back at it by the end of the night. Right now, wish right now, wish right now.